Hi all, welcome to Homeschooling with Hera. I hope everyone is well. In today's video, I'm going to share with you something new and that is that how you can create worksheets yourself. So if you are a teacher or a homeschooling mom who wants to customize worksheet or activity pages, this video is just for you. If you want to learn this, stay with me to the end of the video. And now without any further ado, let's dive in. Alright, so the first thing that you need to do is to go to Google and search for canva.com. Okay, you just write it here and here it is. Now, if you already have an account, uh, you will land on this page. Otherwise, Canva will simply ask you for a free sign up. Now it's asking you what you will be using Canva for large company, nonprofit or charity, teacher, student, small business personal. So just click teacher. It will be good. Where do you work? Some uh, basic information. Let me just click anything and then continue. These things are just not necessary. Mm, claim for claim Canva for education for free. If you are a teacher and you have a proper certificate that you can upload here to get the pro version for free, go for that. I have a pro version for free because I am a TESOL and TEFL certified teacher. So I just paid nothing but got the pro features at zero cost, right? So let's just skip all these things. We need to land here. Here is your Canva account. Now let's, uh, what do you want to make? You want to make a worksheet what will your design what will you design today right here worksheet and then enter it once you have written it here it will give you lots and lots of templates look at this you have multiple templates whatever you want to create you can start creating uh, by selecting any one of uh, them or you can go to a simple blank page Okay, I have selected a simple blank page. Now let's suppose that I want to create a simple phonics worksheet. For example, skip tour. So we are going to design a worksheet. Here are some free templates that you can use. I'm not going to use any of them. Rather, I will go to elements. Look at this elements. And here I will write. For example, my idea is to create a phonics worksheet for letter P. So I am going to find some things that have the P sound, P sound in them. My first search is parrot. So here you are in graphics. Let's see all different types of parrots are here. So I will take maybe this one. This is the simplest. Okay. Now I can resize it. Look at this. It's a parrot. Uh, second thing that I want with P can be a pot. Let's write pot. Now you can see we can even take photos. We can even go for graphics. Even you have the videos for pots. But we are not going to the videos. Let's select any pot. Go for this one. So this picture has watermarks, so please don't use the pictures in which you have a watermark. Otherwise, you will face difficulty to download them. Just go for a simpler one. Look at this. The pro is written here. I have the pro version, but because I'm using another account to show you, that's why uh, I cannot use the pro items here. So, but even if you don't have uh, the pro version, we have multiple choice here. You can use lots and lots of options if not in graphics go to photos go to videos there will be so many things that you can use for free okay parrot pot let's go for panther search for panther okay here are some panthers let's find out for something that is free and good what about this it's black and white we can even search for something better kind of this if you, if you are not finding a good picture for pencil let's go for some other thing pencil or pen pencil yeah we have got some good pencils here remove 
this with a back space remove this with a back space the pencil is here resize it put it here and now let me just put a random picture here for example this frog now what is the caption of my worksheet i want my kids to circle the uh, things that have a p sound and cross the thing that doesn't have a p sound so i will write the text here this is the text box you can simply press t on your keyboard and a text box will appear here you can select any text from here or simply go for this because you are putting the heading and then write uh, cross the picture that doesn't have sound. This is your caption. So I think I missed writing the here. Now resize it, make it according to your page. You can see the frame is also here if you want to do. Now, if you want to write it like this, let it be. Otherwise, you can adjust it a little more. And if you want to give borders, again, go to elements, go to lines and shapes and find out a square. Do something like this. Okay, if you want to go for red borders, if you just click on this rectangle and these three dots, then position, and you will find backward to the back to the back means it will go right to the back, everything will come in front. Now, select another square and then arrange it like this. So, now this is yellow. I don't want yellow, I want a white background. Now, let's again. Uh, we need to position it rightly. Either right click on the box, you will get this option. Send to the back. Okay, once again, now the white is at the back. We want to send red to the back. Look at this. Red is at the back now and you have got a border here. Now cross the picture that doesn't have P sound. Now what you need to do, if you have any uh, watermark, you can add your watermark to the worksheet. You can write your copyright uh, statement here or you can simply share click here on share and then download always download the, these things in pdf for a better quality printing now in pdf even you have two options pdf suggested for emailing and documents and pdf for print go for pdf for print and then click on download it's downloaded you can see how fast it is and later you can simply send it to your students and if you are making it for yourself just print the worksheet and work on it this was a really simple idea but you can create lots and lots of things whatever you want to create whether it's a grammar worksheet whether it's a math worksheet or even hindi urdu worksheets can be made you need to have a urdu or hindi keyboard just to type here otherwise each and everything all the pictures are here in elements just write here in search elements will give you all your related uh, things okay related pictures or ideas let's have a look at our downloaded thing this is how our worksheet finally look like and this is how i have created tons and tons of worksheets and you can see them on my website homeschoolingwithhera.com so now if you want to create your worksheets yourself for your kids for your students go ahead use canva and just blast it i hope you found this video useful if yes so please give it a thumbs up share the video with your friends and family i'll see you soon with something new take care bye for now and don't forget to make it a great day bye